Hey guys, what's up? Beast from Beast Toys are coming at you. Got an opening of a G.I. Joe classified Kamakura, supposed to be. Uh, Amazon and Pulse exclusive. Um, these were actually sold out on Amazon for a short period of time. I couldn't find it. Um, I check Amazon almost daily to make sure nothing's gone on sale troop wise or anything I can troop build or offer. So keep an eye on it. Anyway, long short. This was had disappeared for about a week or two, and uh, I had these pre-ordered. Changed my mind. I'm gonna be honest. Don't kill me if you're a Joe fan. I didn't really know much about this Kamakura fella, and he is number 61. And also another reason now that I'm only I'm only gonna um, I'm not gonna buy much past 50. I'm, I'm not really collecting doubles past 50. I'm gonna try to get up to about 50 and then stop, um, you know, for now. Um, I, I honestly had suspected this guy would end up going on sale and he probably will because him and all of a sudden he's back up on Pulse, he's back up on Amazon. I went ahead and of course decided what the heck, I'm gonna pick one up. So here he is, we're gonna do an opening does have good artwork. I like the front where he's kicking the Cobra. Uh, trooper or Officer. Looks like Trooper. Kicking Cobra Troopers. Anyway, so there he is. Um, there's the artwork. Of course, you got the new windowless box. So everything's going to be... There he is, packaged separately. And <clears throat> comes with the boxed goods. Um, as you can see, I do kind of think that is neat, but, uh, I think, I think that's why they give you so much. I guess, I guess, I guess this is all a lot cheaper than the plastic, giving you all the plastic in there. Like, well, we can throw in this cool numbered box with their name on the front. See, Tamakura, like they have been doing, you know, we could, we could throw that in and you know, we're going to save money and not pollute or give you recycle, which plastic's recyclable, so I don't understand why it's even a big deal, truthfully. Um, maybe I'm missing something. Sorry. Could be missing something. Anyway, so, got our weapons and our cast. Let's get the big guy himself out. He is, uh, I believe he's part of uh, Snake Eyes's uh, group. I can never remember. I want to say the Lin Kai, but that's a Sub-Zero or a Scorpion. <laughs> anyway, those dudes, he's part of that, I believe. So people were, I know there were Joe fans excited to see him. Like I said, I'm probably too old for this character. My guess is I'm too old for this character. I think he probably came out in the 90s. Um, <clears throat> By the early 90s, I was out of the toy business because I was getting into high school. So, very early 90s, mind you. Um, so, I went to middle school and at the end of 80. Well, I can tell you this much. I was a freshman in 91. Fall of 91. So, uh, pretty much out of toys at that point. 14 out of toys. Yes, I was. For the time being, but uh, look what comes back around as you get older. Anyway, so I didn't know much about this fella. Anyway, he looks cool either way. I and I'm anyway, you know, when I said he'd been out on Amazon, so kind of was like, oh crap. Well, I may have missed the boat on this one, thinking he'll end up going on sale. Well, he didn't really. However, he did come back around, so uh, that's the good part. Now. Yeah, it's head. It feels like this head is tilted one one hard way to the right. Yeah. When I turn it, it feels like, like I want to turn it to get his head straight. Well, at any rate, here he is. G.I. Joe Ninja. You know, we get a Kamakura before we get a Jinx? Really? Jinx was in the movie. I don't know. Call me crazy. I think we should have got a Jinx first, maybe. Or no, Quick Kick. Oh, my gosh. What am I thinking? Quick Kick. I have seen some good. Hey, I'll tell you what. That Serpentor's legs were tight, too. What are they doing, Hasbro? 
I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm all for having deer tight joints so they don't bend and fall over so easy. Man, these are like overly tight. I don't know if you can see my serpentors right here. I don't even know if that's in the view. I've got, I'm getting so much junk. I'm trying to, I'm going to have to rearrange stuff as we go. All right. Well, anyhow, I like this look better. He does have a different head, but this head's driving me insane. I'm telling you, it's like, it, it's like it leans and I try to push and it just, it does this and goes right back to where it was. I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but, uh, He's pretty cool. Let's see what let's see what accessories we got here. I know we got some swords and some stuff of that nature. So let's see what we got here. These are gonna be tricky to get out. Looks like a couple of staffs. Well, those are two katanas, maybe. Two swords. And a staff here. Double, double bladed staff. Got the Jedi Darth Maul look here. Pretty cool. I must say. Throw that back in there. What have we here? More goodies of sorts. More weapons of sort. I feel like they're attached, but they're not, they shouldn't have to be. Uzi, snake eyes Uzi. So that much stays constant. There's a constant there. Got something. Can't get them out. Here's one thing coming. Oh, there's a katana right there. So I don't know my swords very well, I guess. Here's my double katana blades. I'm not sure what these other. These long-handled short blades are. And last but not least, this will be our extra head, backpack, or whatever will hold the... Oh, we got a gun, too. Oh, he comes with the hood. That's cool. Got the uh, Storm Shadow hood. Got the. Well, that doesn't open. You gotta put that on around his neck prior to. Knife. Sword holder. Goes on the back. That is the same. Blue Ninjas, I think, have those. By the way, those are on sale on Pulse. If you are premium, you get them for 30 something. I'm even contemplating on ordering another set myself i've got three i open one i've got two more unopened so i don't know can't decide if it's even worth the you know worth it to get another one all right so let's see what we can do with him here where's my knife sheath i don't see it all right this goes on the back yeah like i don't see i would have thought he would have had a place to put his knife which he doesn't no pistol holster you know me if you if you pay it if you watch me enough and you pay attention you know i like having holsters for my pistols so that's kind of a stinky that thing doesn't stay on very well i don't understand why they do these with these uh like this piece doesn't even stay on very well falls off pretty easily I kind of hate that. I hate getting pieces of stuff like that, and then they don't stay very well. Put those katanas in there, though. Uh, we're getting more of a look. Let's try the scarf, the neck piece. It's weird. It's not like it doesn't want to get on there very well. We'll put the 
We'll put this red head on, make him look like a ginger. Maybe. I don't know if it wants to go on with that. That thing on. I want to put the helmet or the hoodie thing on too. There's Kenny. Just kidding. I think we want to. I don't know. I guess you don't really want that scarf on. I'm having a problem because I don't hear it snapping. Like, so I don't feel like the head's on there good. All right, well, there it is. I know you hear that enthusiasm in my voice. There it is. It's, I just feel like it's not working very well. But he has an extra pistol. I don't know if I showed you that. So it comes with the pistol. You're not going to put blast effects in that pistol, by the way. And you're not going to put them in this one either. He gave you got two pistols. You can't put blast effects on them. Put a silencer. You got silent. Well, did he get a silencer? Now, if he had a silencer, that would be smart with a ninja. I mean, don't ninjas, aren't ninjas supposed to be silent? Well, he doesn't have one, but Hasbro needs to take notes on that one. Give a ninja a silencer for crying out loud. So here's this. Let's try a different look here. Oh, well, I guess I did have it on there. Let me see if I can get the scarf piece on with this. Yeah. Got it on there. All right. <clears throat> so... I feel like now we just need to give him a weapons in his hand. I like the staff myself. I think it gives him a good look. You can also double up on that. But hey, here we go. So here he is, guys, Kamakura. So is he worth the deluxe? No, absolutely not. I don't really care for deluxe pricing because you get some extra junk or stuff. Shouldn't call it junk. I mean, it's cool. You know, we got the pistol, extra pistol, and an Uzi, which you can put a silencer on. You cannot blast effect these. Extra knife, which the only part about this that bothers me is I don't see a sheath to, to, to put it in. I would put it in, you know, or a holster for his gun, pistol, which would be nice. Uh, but he's a ninja, so I guess I get that. But at the same time, you know, it's, it's just loose parts. You know, extra head, extra hood, extra of these. So, I mean, yeah, he comes with some good accessories, but is it worth the $33? No. Um, you know, I didn't, truthfully, this figure should be $24.99. Our regular figure should be $19.99. The price increase, I don't know, if you ask me, it's going to hurt them in the long run, but uh, I'm not going to get on that soapbox. You came here to check out Kamakura, so there's you, there's you a good look. I want to give you a look at him. You don't always necessarily want to hear my opinion, but I'm sure you would agree that you'd rather pay less for a figure, so anyway. $33.99 is worth it. No, but he is a neat figure nonetheless. Again, don't don't get mad because I don't know exactly his backstory. Um, I didn't read a whole lot of the comics as a kid. I had a handful here and there when I was little. Uh, mainly a skimmer when I was a kid. Didn't like to read much, but um, never know. I may catch up on stuff like that as I get older when I have time. But uh, at the moment, don't have time. So anyway, that being said, though, Tom Kerr, number 61, Amazon exclusive, Pulse exclusive. Check him out. Get him. Wait for a sale, I would say. Uh, but nonetheless, get him when you get a chance, though, um, before he's gone. So 
that's kind of what I thought. But here we are. I checked again today. He's sitting there on both sides. So that's why I only bought one. Don't have an extra one. So at this point, now I'll catch him on sale later on. I want to add to my collection. Maybe my unbox collection. We'll see. But uh, anyway, hit that like and subscribe button. You want to check out more videos. Guys, thanks for watching. And uh, oh yeah, by the way, it is Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. I'm Beast from Beast Toys. We'll see you.